Go be bohemian in Bohemia. What did you think you were serving? Because like I said, I know it ain't looks. Dumpster. Garbage disposal. Not cute. What's good? What's poppin'? It's your boy Denzel Diana. Welcome back to my channel. Are you poppin'? Because I know I am. Okay, I am back with another video. Yes, and as you guys see by this title, this is going to be a Best of Us Coachella outfit. I told you guys I was doing this video about a month ago when Coachella comes around, and she's been around. We can choose this weekend. And now for my previous video that I posted, I had very mixed reviews. And like I said, like I'm going to always say my Best of Us videos. I said what I said, and I meant what I said, and I said what I meant. If you don't like it, then girl, Oh, click off, okay? You still viewed it, you still liked it, I still got my coins. And for the haters on my last video, Denzel, you're so fat, you're so ugly, your hair this, your hair that, you don't know how to dress, you don't know what fashion is, these people killed it, you did not, you look like a UPS driver. All I'm gonna say is, to the hate comments, all I'll do is just leave my Vogue link in the description below. Bitch read. If you have a problem with what I say, what I do, I really don't care. And if you think I don't know anything about fashion, whatever that is your opinion, you're entitled to your own opinion. However, you're not entitled to your own fact. So in that case, I'll leave my Vogue article in the description below so you haters can read, okay? That's it. Hey darling, if this is your first time seeing my face or know of my existence, please click that subscribe button. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. That helps me a lot. If you are watching this video right now, stop this video right now. Give this video a big fat thick thumbs up, okay? Without further ado, let's get right on into this video. Shall we, darling? Okay, now let's go to our first person for Coachella. We have Miss Kourtney Kardashian. I actually do love this outfit. I love sportswear for Coachella. I don't know why, that's just me. I'm loving this whole neon thing. She's really working it with the white Yeezys with the socks. This is giving me like 1980s, 1990s vibes and I really do love it. You girl, a hot mama. Oh my gosh, she looks so sexy. I'm living for this whole lime green neon thing. You know, I'm living for it. Now, let's go to her man. His name is Eunice, if I pronounce that right. I don't know. This is so crazy. This is legit the same outfit I was going to wear, but I left it at home for some reason. I just felt like, eh, it was cute, but I felt like I wanted to just wear it to like a party, but not to Coachella. And her man wore the same exact thing I was going to wear. It's the same exact vest. I was going to wear this vest with these type of pants, with my white Balenciagas, and a white tank top, and just kept it cute and simple. But damn, he looks so good in this. And he did this with the beige Yeezys. This is so nice. This is actually a nice look. Like, I'm living for this. Like, y'all know I love my vests. Y'all know I love my military bulletproof. You know I live. I live. And so now we have Miss Bella Hadid. I don't know what day this was. But she looks good. This is so nice. I, I love her little 2000 outfits. I actually do like this. Like, I actually do mess with this a lot. I'm so happy she didn't have no face juice on and have, you know, tool and fringes down her pants and all that stuff. But I don't know. I just really do love the simple 2000s. Like, this is giving me very Spice Girls. I don't know why, but it is. It's the high pony with the scrunchie. This is very 80s. It's 80s. It's 90s. And it's early 2000s. Does that make sense? If it doesn't, oh well, you get what I'm saying. And now we have the girls from Riverdale. I've never watched Riverdale, don't come for me. But I do know their real names. We have Camilla Mendez and we have Vanessa Morgan, I believe that's her name. Let's start with Camilla. Now y'all know that I don't do floral. I hate floral prints. I hate trees and beaches and stuff. On It's because it's just ugly to me. Like, it's just actually very ugly to me. For her, I'm not feeling her look at all. The top is very nice, it's very cute. She would have paired it with like some nice denim shorts. It would have been good. Just the fact that the bottom is floral, that whole outfit is just ugly to me now. I'm, I'm so sorry. For Vanessa, I like the little face jewels, you know. I mean, it's not too much. It's nice. It's subtle. With the baby blue, love that color. I actually want to wrap my car in this color, but let's get back to this. I love the baby blue with the blue jean. This is actually cute with the black boot. It's nice. It's cute. Kendall, girl. I like the top, I like the bag, I like the shoes. However, those pants are god ugly. They're hideous. What type of pants are these? I don't know why, they're just not working for me. I don't know why. These pants are just so ugly to me. I don't know, this is giving me like Laura Croft, Tomb Raider, but Walmart version. You know what I mean? It's not giving me Chanel version. It just looks like a costume. I don't like the pants, but overall the outfit is nice. But I mean, the pants, the overall outfit is just not cute then. Like, cause the pants just messed up the whole outfit. Okay, and now we have Miss Beyonce. This is one of Beyonce's looks. She did, actually didn't walk around Coachella because Beyonce would never. She would never, but this is from her performances. Oh, I'm loving this bejeweled thing. This is a queen. She showed up. I was actually there, by the way, okay? I was actually there, like, actually, like, saw her. I love the cake. Oh, give me royalty. Give it to me. Love Beyonce. Love her. Love this look. This look was actually wow. I thought she was going to perform it. I really want her to take off the cape and hood, hood. Hey, 
you know, I wanted her to give it to me, but you know what? She just walked back and then she just, you know, changed. And when she changed, she changed into this outfit. I thought this outfit was actually so cute. It looked so comfortable for her to perform in to really like show you this yellow sweater with this blue denim D with those boots. Uh, Beyonce just gets it every time. Wait, not every time. Not every time. I love Beyonce, but I do have to say, this look though, this one was the ugliest look to me out of all her performance outfits. Just because, one, like, I know she can't control this, but they should have done rehearsals in all her outfits to see if they were gonna fall off. This kept falling off. This thing she had on just kept falling off, like her breasts were about to pop out, she kept putting it in. Like, I know it was annoying her, because I know Beyonce's a perfectionist, and she was like, like, you know, you got to tell about her face, and she was trying to smile, but she was like, this shit. This shit keeps falling off. For some reason, I think it's Miss Tina. I think it's House of Darion, but you know, we're not gonna get into that tea today. And next, we have Miss Amber Rose. This is so sexy. This is so cute. Oh, I love Amber Rose with the diamond choker. With the, I love Amber Rose. This is actually so cute. Like, this screams coach out to me. It doesn't scream coach out to me, but it's actually, like, nice. Like, you know, it's so nice. Like, if I was a girl, I would wear this. This is so nice. Oh, I love her. Her caption was, Hochella. Come on, girl. I live for a sexy woman. Yes, I do. A sexy mother at that. Come on, girl. And now, we we have Miss Victoria Justice and sweetie, I'm going to freak the freak out. Girl, what in the Nickelodeon is this? What in the Victorious is this? Tori would never, but Victorious, she did, and it's actually so ugly. This half light denim and half dark denim with this raggedy bell, girl, bye. And she thought it was a look I folded it in. You need a new status, Victoria, you do. I love you and all, I really do, but I have to give it to you, I have to give it to you straight, no chaser. And this is just hideous, I'm so sorry, I don't know why it just looks so ugly to me. Like, it's not that bad, the fabric just gives me polyester, you know? And next we have Miss Madison Pettis. Come on, Cory in the house. This is actually so nice. I like this little ensemble. She's grown up. Like, this just shows you I'm even getting older. She looks good. I love red. I love red. I love red. Oh, I love a red set. That little skin tight thing, the template. Girl, I thought we left that three years ago. But you know, I'll give you a pass. It's still cute. It just looks tacky. It looks tacky. And now, let's go to Miss Rihanna. Now, y'all know I love Rihanna. For this look, I love this 60s look. Rihanna, girl, Rihanna is fashion. Like, you can't spell fashion without Rihanna. Come on. Like, this is so cute. I love this set. Y'all know I look for a set. With the seatbelt on the side. Yes, Rihanna, with this eye makeup, with this swoop. Come on, girl, give it to me. I love this look. Now let's go to her second look. It's been a week since Coachella. I'm still trying to understand this brown tool thing, Riri. Girl, I love you to death. I love you, girl. You know I love you, but I just don't understand this. You know, maybe I'm not that fashion-esque enough to understand, that, understand this. It's not ugly. Like, it's like, <gasps> this is ugly. Because Rihanna's worn some stuff, and I'm like, oh my god, girl, like... You messed up this time, but we all make mistakes. I stay at it longer, it just becomes more of a look to me. But for now, she's okay. I don't get this. I feel like once someone just pulls one out, girl, that's it. The show is revealed. The nips are out. I like this, but then I don't like it. Like, you know what I mean? It's like half and half. But for her last outfit, girl, I love this outfit, Rihanna. I really do love you. But girl, if you are not hot, you are bionic. There's no way that you're not hot in this outfit. Like, if we're basing this outfit on fashion, this is fashion. Okay? This is a look, babe. Not with a K at the end with a Q, a look. But if we're basing it on the weather and the climate, girl, girl, I don't know about all this. Rihanna, you can't tell me your JJ wasn't burning, girl, because it was hot. It was hot. This is such a look. You know what? Actually, if I was Rihanna, I would wear this because, you know, it's fashion. When it's fashion, you don't care about the climate outside. You don't care if it's hot or it's cold. You don't. You need to wear what you need to wear. And now we have my best bitch, my best bitch. Miss Onika Mirage, y'all know her by Nicki Minaj. I just call her Onik, cause we're friends like that, okay? Nicki girl, you know I love you. You know I love you. Like I stand Miss Nicki Minaj. Like I was standing her since MySpace. Nicki girl, I love you so much. I gotta tell you, this is actually trash. This is hideous. Like wh who put this on your body, girl? This has got to be so ugly. Like Coachella, girl, you should have fucked it up. This was not cute. You fucked up the outfit. You didn't fuck it up. You fucked. Okay, girl, you only have lions and tigers and bears running across your midway section. You have cheetah print, you have zebra print. Girl, you got all types of animal prints in it. Girl, what type of animal do you love? Girl, what type of zoo are you in? What type of kingdom are you in? Girl, you're saving lions, tigers, and bears. And girl, you got nipple tassels on your eyes. Are these nipple tassels? Hold on, let me zoom in. I was not living for this look at all with this gold shiny bag. The bangles were cute, that's about it. The wig, cute, that's about it. The makeup, cute. However, what's on that body? Gotta go, girl. You're giving me too much. If you're gonna give me cheetah, give me cheetah. Don't give me cheetah. Lions, tigers, bears, zebras, donkeys, seahorses. Girl gave me the whole zoo with this fit. But you know what? I love you. And now we have Garrett Clayton. I don't know why someone sent me this photo. Like, 
What? He was in Teen Beach Movie, and this has got to be the most ugliest shit I have ever seen in my life. What type of high top sneakers are these with these white jorts? And this top with the white, this is god ugly, this is god awful, this is so ugly. I don't know what world this is cute, and this is actually so ugly. Like, if you say this is cute, you're brainwashed, you actually have problems. Like, this is actually god ugly. The only thing that excites about this outfit is the bandana that's on his wrist. What did you think you were serving? Because like I said, I know it ain't looks. Dumpster. Garbage disposal. Not cute. And now we have Halsey and G-Eazy. g, -Eazy. g -Eazy just ugly. Just whatever. Halsey, this is cute, but for some reason, your outfit is reminding me of toilet paper. It looks like toilet paper. I don't know why. For some reason, Halsey's outfit is giving me very toilet trees, bitch. It's giving me very Charmin Ultra Strong. Very bounty, okay? I don't know. It just reminds me of paper towels and toilet trees. The quick picker upper, okay? And now, last but not least, we have my girl, Miss Kylie Jenner, that bitch, okay? How do you do it? Girl, how do you do it? I'm loving this. I'm loving this camo latex or patent leather set with that white crop top with that hot pink wig. Kylie just does it every time. This is a bomb ass outfit. This is a bomb ass outfit. Come on, mother. Come on, Kylie Jenner. She makes me want to be a mother, you know what I mean? But this is actually such a cute outfit. I'm living for this. I am living for this look. This makeup is so subtle. Like I said, simple and cute. That was the theme for Coachella this year. Be simple and cute, girl. All that extraness, bitch, we done left in 2013-2014. Go be Bohemian in Bohemia. Is Bohemia a country? I don't know. Or Ireland? Go be Bohemia there. But over here, sis, we're being simple and cute. Because we don't got time for that. And now let's get into the YouTubers because I know people want to see me talk about more YouTubers. So here you go, sweetie. Here you go. First, we have Jake Paul. This is actually god awful, but I mean, it's Jake Paul. Like, I've never seen him wear one outfit that looks good to me. Like, it's Jake Paul. I mean, oh, this makes sense. This is why Erica dressed like that. I, I forgot they're together. Makes total sense. This is ugly. This is hideous. What are you wearing? What's on your body? You have palm trees. Like, this is too tropical for me. Like, what in the Kawabunga is this, bitch? This is ugly. Kawabunga somewhere else. This is Coachella. You gonna get Kawabunga in? Girl! Ugly. It's hideous. But the red bandana just makes it more ugly. Next, we have, um, Brandon Taylor. Mm -mm. It's not a look to me. This outfit is not cute. I've seen like 15 people at the same time you shirt. The pants, I mean, they're too baggy, but they're cute. They weren't put together in the right type of way. And the shades just doesn't match. The shades just doesn't go together. Love Brennan and all, but he knows I always gotta tell him how it is. You know how stuff looks better when it's not put on the person? This is that type of case. And for this outfit, the shirt was nice. It's a vintage guest shirt, but the jorts, Really? Jorts? And then, oh, uh, this is another situation. You cannot wear Nike socks with Converse's. You can't do that. You can't. Uh, get regular Hanes white plain socks, but yeah, he messed up with that. The looks were not being served. I see what Brennan was going for, but he quite didn't hit the mark. This is just not cute, you know what I mean? Like, next! Okay, so now we have Ethan Dolan. Now, I forgot to say this in my other video, because I don't know why I forgot to say this in my other video, but this outfit from Ethan is actually so nice. Like, this is actually such a nice outfit. I'm The boys are getting better. Hallelujah. Hallelujah! I love this! It's simple but cute, I mean. An orange bandana, a black tank top, show off those muscles, show off what you worked for. The chest popped, okay? Stomach bop, okay? Leg tattoo showing through these black ripped jeans. And then he has orange bands with the orange bandana with the orange phone case. Come on, color coordination! Ethan, thank you for this, please. This is what I've been wanting. Improvements, better. And next we have Alyssa Ashley. I love this outfit. Give me Survivor, girl. Give me Destiny's Child, Survivor. Give me ARMY. However, I always say this before people try to clock me. You can wear ARMY if it's green. Green ARMY will never run out. It will never be out of style because it's the ARMY. It's green ARMY. However, your blues, your pinks, your whites, your yellows, your grays, your blacks, gotta go. But And I love for color coordination. I love for the ARMY. You see how she did the ARMY pants with the ARMY um, green belt? And she did it with a, a nice, like, nude, like, light brown, you know, boot sneaker thing with that top. Come on, Alyssa, you did it. I love this. And now we have Miss Summer Rae. When you see Summer Rae, you know the butt's gonna be out. Like, girl, she worked hard for that, so it's gonna be out. This outfit is cute, however, like, it's a very nice outfit. Why would you wear white panties in this? If you had a black top on, you're supposed to match. This is supposed to be a black panty under this net shorts. I mean, I guess she wanted to pop out more, but girl, yeah, this outfit is just ugly to me now. Like, I hate 
girls who mix and match lingerie wear. Like, if you have a black top on, make sure your underwear is black if you're seeing your underwear so it can match. It's just, it looks very tacky now. It just looks trashy. It just looks dusty, you know? And for the next person we have, we have Manu MUA. He looks good. This is basic. Like, I like how basic this is. You see, that's why I really do mess with beauty gurus when it comes to stuff like this sometimes. Because you know what? Their outfits can be so simple, but it's the makeup that's like, damn. Okay, I see what you're working with. I mean, it's nice. Like, the black pants, the black top. You never go wrong with the black top and the black pants. I always tell you, like, there's no, like, you can never go wrong. You can never go wrong. You know, the face makeup, B, and it's cute. Cute, simple, that's it. Serving me very Danny Phantom Brunus. Best and worst looks. Okay, the best look. Oh, I can't choose between two, but I really do love Kylie's outfit. I don't know why. It's just so simple. I just really do love it. We have the Rihanna 60s outfit and Kylie Jenner's latex outfit. Those are just the two best to me. I don't know why. Like, ah, oh, I just love Kylie's thing and I just love Rihanna's set. But if I do have to choose between the two who's giving me more fashion, if we speak more fashion, I will say Riri, Miss Baggerini. And for the worst, the worst look of this whole Coachella thing, it has really got to be Jake Paul. This is actually god awful and so ugly. Can you please come a bugger and Johnny Tsunami over there, please? This is Coachella, okay? That was it for this video. Give this video a big thumbs up. If you like to like, comment, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Like I said, you see me, I'm doing it. You watch, I post. You to watch, I don't post. So watch. And until then, see you later, my darlings. Bye. Toodaloo.